My beloved child, listen, for I have important and precious words for you. I am here to bring peace and grace into your life. I ask for your attention, just a moment of your time. Today, I bring a message of love, comfort, and strength. Do not overlook or ignore this message. Listen to it. Hold it in your heart. For these words will bring grace and blessings into your life. My dear child, today I want to share the depth of my love for you, a love that is pure and true. I will always strive to fill your life with love, surrounding you with peace and comfort. In times of hardship and challenge, find solace and protection in my unwavering presence. I want you to comprehend that I have a grand purpose for you. The work I shall perform within you shall be extraordinary, for nothing is beyond my grasp. In this wondrous time during which you acquaint yourself with me, I have instilled in you the desire to grow and progress towards the destiny of blessing that I have fashioned for your life. It is imperative that you place your trust in my promises and the veracity of my word, for it shall come to pass for the benefit and blessing of those who hold me in their hearts. Therefore, I affirm today that there is an area in which you have faltered, and I point it out not to cause you distress or accusation, but so that you may rectify it in obedience to my word, thereby multiplying all your blessings. Indeed, it is obedience to my word that shall unlock all the doors and windows of heaven, guiding you towards your path of blessing and prosperity. Only then can you attain your divine goals, dreams and aspirations in a supernatural manner. You must fathom that it is imperative to purge your heart of all complaints, doubts and negativity. My dear child, your faith pleases me greatly, but do not allow the venom of complaint to wither your sincere belief. Banish negative sentiments and pessimistic thoughts, for they may grow and, when least expected, wither your beautiful faith and hope. Remove complaints from your lips and distance yourself from friendships that consistently sow seeds of intrigue, doubt, and grievances. Seek wise companions, surround yourself with virtuous and honest individuals, and cherish integrity and truth. Pursue peace and never repay evil with evil, but love your neighbor and share with those in need. Please, believe what I convey to you today and do not reject my words. Have faith and cling to them, for the blessings I offer today will come to fruition and manifest when you decide to believe in these powerful words. It is time to put your faith into practice and embrace hope, for they are like seeds planted in your heart that will yield beautiful fruits, bringing about marvelous occurrences in every area of your life. These seeds will initiate a season of blessing and provision, not only for you, but for your entire family. You shall experience healing, familial harmony, joy in your soul, and happiness shall fill your heart. So, do not grow weary of doing good, for I assure you that, in due season, you shall reap abundant blessings. Stand firm and unwavering, even amidst your doubts and challenges. Never give up. Maintain the certainty that the radiance of your faith will dispel any shadows, paving the way for my grace and favor upon you. The blessings I shall pour upon you shall follow you like a loyal shadow, enveloping you with its mantle in every step you take. Provision shall flow like an inexhaustible river, bringing forth all that you require at the precise moment. Freedom shall be a sensation of lightness in your soul, allowing you to soar without chains, savoring each moment as a precious gift. Joy shall take root deep within you, becoming a constant melody that dances in your soul. Happiness, that overflowing delight that resonates in every beat of your heart, shall serve as an undeniable sign of my love and divine purpose for you. My dear child, I love you with an affection that surpasses all measure and comprehension. Therefore, 
Embrace my promises tightly and engrave them within you, for each of them shall come to fruition in perfect time. Hence, take a step of faith at this very moment. Surrender your doubts and fears to me, and permit me to bear the burden of your cares so that you may walk in tranquility and lightness. Bid farewell to complaints and negativity, allowing me to transform every challenge into an opportunity and every trial into a victory. Allow me to bless you in ways that will exceed all your expectations, providing the necessary provision to meet all your needs. Believe it, I will do it, for with me by your side you shall reach your calling faster and farther. Focus solely on seeking my face day and night, and I shall attend to all your concerns. You shall witness this wonderful and powerful promise come to pass. Eye has not seen, nor ear heard, nor have entered into the heart of man the things which God has prepared for those who love him. Today I bless you and declare you free from chains, restored in your finances, and prosperous in all your endeavors. Beloved child, in this moment of communion, I address you with words brimming with promises and power. Listen attentively, for I desire to etch them deep within your heart. I am your Heavenly Father, the omnipotent God who watches over you at all times. It is out of my boundless love for you that I have chosen to speak to you and reveal my purpose for your life. Know that I am acquainted with your needs and desires, even before you voice them. That is why I come to you today, to assure you that I will supply all your needs, grant the desires of your heart, and restore your finances. Therefore, my dear child, do not fear or be astonished by what I shall do in your life, for I shall restore all aspects of your being. I shall heal your soul and reinstate the peace you had lost. The debts that burden you shall be settled. All challenges that seem insurmountable you will overcome, for I am by your side, granting you strength and momentum to move forward. Know that all your endeavors shall thrive. Your hard work, dedication and perseverance shall not be in vain. Each seed you plant in faith will grow and bear abundant fruit. There will be no financial commitment beyond your reach, for I will provide you with wisdom to manage the blessings I bestow upon you. Watch as doors of blessings open before you. Prosperity will enter your life in many forms, material, emotional, and spiritual, enhancing your life and those around you. But remember, my child, prosperity is not just earthly wealth. It is a state of completeness in every aspect of your being. As you prosper, Stay faithful in small things, and I will entrust you with greater things. Remember, my blessings call for obedience and responsible stewardship of all I give you. Keep a humble and generous heart, always ready to share with those in need, especially the less fortunate. Prepare your heart to be a channel of blessings to many. My child, be aware that you will face challenges and obstacles that test your faith. Fear not, for I will be with you, strengthening and guiding you. Do not let adversity discourage you, for in trials your character is shaped and your trust in me is proven. My plan for you goes beyond the material. While I may restore your finances and settle your debts, I desire your deep spiritual transformation. May your relationship with me deepen and your faith grow with each victory and challenge. Trust in my word, for I am faithful and keep my promises. My love and power know no bounds. If you cling to me and entrust yourself to my care, you will experience my supernatural blessings. Hold tightly to my love and grace and live knowing that your finances will be restored, your debts paid, and your burdens eased. Scarcity will not touch your household, nor afflict your descendants. I will lavish abundance in every area of your life. Fear not, for my grace is sufficient and my mercy everlasting. Walk in obedience and faith, 
trusting that I will never leave you. You will be a testament to my miraculous provision, and others will see the truth of my promises in your life. So receive this message with joy and gratitude. Declare that your finances will be restored, your debts paid, and all you do will prosper, for you are my beloved child. I ask you to keep your heart open to my voice and guidance. In each step, seek my wisdom and trust in my plan. Do not be discouraged by adversities as they bring opportunities for growth and strength. Your faith in me will be richly rewarded. Do not worry about tomorrow, nor fear obstacles in your path. Focus on me, the author of faith. Have confidence that I am your provider and will never forsake you. My love for you is unconditional, and I desire your prosperity in every area. Remember these words as a reminder of my commitment, love, and desire to bless you abundantly. Today, I bless you and declare you free from debt, restored in finances, and prosperous in all endeavors. Build your life on the solid rock of Christ, and you will achieve your goals. In this world, you will face trials and challenges that test your faith and character. Today, I advise you to build your life on the unshakable rock of Christ Jesus. Ground yourself in my word and principles and not be swayed by the whims of the times. Do not be lured by worldly desires or let them harden your heart. They are like shifting sands, bringing shame and failure. The paths of this world are futile and deceitful, leading to doubt and fear. Stay alert and prepared for trials. Stand firm, equipped with spiritual tools and clothed in my power. Do not let the enemy's shadows cloud your mind or his lies darken your heart. Beware of false and enticing words that seek to steal your blessings and divert you from my divine purpose. Trust in me and do not allow yourself to be swayed by the falsehoods that may attempt to divert you from my path. Remember that you are my child, my creation, my masterpiece, and I have instilled within you the truth and the light of my word. Place your trust in my love and the wise counsel I offer you today. Do not forget that I will always desire the best for your life, seeking your well-being and standing by your side to guide and shield you from the snares of the adversary. So, when you are tempted to heed those malevolent voices, the ones that whisper lies and seek to sow doubt in your heart, rebuke them and cast them aside. Seek refuge in my word and in prayer. Cling to them and you will find the strength you require and protection for your soul. In my presence, you will always discover rest, peace, and the joy you seek. Therefore, once more, I say to you, my beloved child, construct your life upon the unshakable rock. For if you do so, storms and difficulties may come, but nothing will move you. Tempests will arise, yet if you build your life upon the steadfastness and strength that only Christ can provide, you shall not be toppled, not even by the fiercest waves or winds. As long as your life is founded upon the rock that is Christ, you shall endure trials and tribulations. For he is the gateway to eternal life, the source of salvation for your soul. Do not doubt my words, beloved child. Trust in me and place all your dreams, goals, and concerns in my hands. I will lead you and provide you with the comfort and strength needed to overcome the challenges that arise in your daily journey. So, if at any moment you feel lost or overwhelmed, remember these words. Build your life upon the unyielding rock that is Christ. In doing so, you will be fully prepared for every good work, resisting the assaults of the enemy, engaging in the battle of faith with the sword of the Spirit, which is my word. Only then will you attain victory and partake in the great and wondrous blessings that I have reserved for you.
With me by your side, nothing and no one can stand against you. Always remember, my child, that I am the eternal rock, your indestructible foundation, always ready to bless and prosper you. If you abide in me, and my words abide within you, everything you ask for will be granted. For I honor those who honor me, and bless those who place their trust in me. May my words be as a seal upon your heart, and may your life remain grounded in the principles of my word. Be just, and act with kindness. Proclaim the truth of my gospel in season and out of season. Bring good news to the poor. Proclaim freedom to the captives. Heal the brokenhearted. Enlighten the eyes of the blind and set the oppressed free. Do not forget that I am always with you and desire the best for you. You are my child, my greatest creation. I will never leave you. Remember that my spirit resides within you, and I have instilled in you a steadfast faith to prevent you from stumbling or sinking into the quicksand. Now rise and walk by faith, claiming each of my promises with certainty and conviction, knowing that your life is built upon the unshakable rock that is Christ. Trust in me, my child, and believe in my words. Then. Everything you ask for in the name of Jesus will be granted. Your chains are broken today. I set you free, blessed, and prospered. Believe it. On this day filled with hope, I want you to know, my child, that I love you, I am with you, and you are surrounded by my grace and divine benevolence. For I am your God and Father, the light that illuminates your path. I am here to break every curse in your life and dispel all the shadows that have obscured your mind, your heart, and your spirit. Listen carefully, my child, for today, doubts and fears that have held your heart captive dissipate. No more uncertainty, no more sadness, and no more confusion. Today, the bonds that prevented your growth are shattered. Today, the chains of curse and scarcity in your life are broken, for I am here to give you life and life in abundance. Allow me to fill you with my peace and wisdom, embrace you with my eternal love, and pour out my blessings upon every facet of your being. I know that the path you have traveled has not been easy. I have witnessed the struggles and trials you face daily. I have seen how the shadows and schemes of the adversary have affected your spiritual journey bringing anxieties and challenges to your faith. But today, in my infinite love, I want to tell you that I am dispelling the shadows that have obscured your path for so long, preventing you from seeing the opportunities and blessings I have placed before you. I break every bond in your life and shatter every link to doubt and fear, liberating you from any negative influence that has disturbed your peace and tranquility. At this moment, I declare freedom over your life. I declare that my divine light illuminates your path, bringing security, joy, and happiness. Today, I proclaim the rupture of every curse that has limited your potential. Where there was once confusion, there will now be clarity and understanding. Where there was insecurity, confidence, and certainty will flourish. Where there was discouragement, I bring hope and renewal to your spirit. My love will flood every corner of your being, providing you with a sense of fullness, peace, and strength. My child, today I extend my loving hand to you. I open the windows of heaven and declare that you will be blessed. The doors of abundance swing wide open, and opportunities you have never before encountered will come your way. Your faith will be strengthened, and you will be like a tree planted by streams of water, yielding abundant fruit in its season, and your leaf shall not wither. In me, you will find the calm you need, the rest, and the answers to your deepest questions. Place your trust in me, my dear child. Have faith in my words and embrace my promises. I assure you, 
that you will be able to partake in a profound and fulfilling life. With me by your side, no uncertainty shall impede your progress, and no challenge shall be insurmountable. The shadows that once obscured your faith, and the influences that disrupted your inner peace, will never thrive within you again. For I will be beside you as the beacon that illuminates your path, an unending source of supernatural blessings. Fear not, beloved child. Fear not to take that step and place your trust in me. For I am the Father who loves you and desires nothing but the best for you. You need only confide in me and follow my guidance. I shall be your unwavering guide and faithful companion. I will never abandon you. Even in moments of spiritual darkness, know that I shall always be with you, and my grace will forever accompany you. I shall provide support in times of doubt and serve as your wellspring of inspiration on your spiritual journey. Therefore, trust in me and allow me to be the guide of your life. Always remember that you are cherished and that your past holds no sway over me. It matters not how challenging the path you've walked may have been. What truly matters is that you are here now, listening to my voice, hearing the whisper in your heart, assuring you of my love. I am here to illuminate your path and help you find the peace, joy, and happiness you long for. So trust in me, my dear child. Trust in my light, my love, and my unwavering faithfulness. I shall never let you down. Never forget that my grace and favor envelop you, and my will is to bless you abundantly. My love for you is boundless, and my faithfulness is unyielding, regardless of how dark the path you may have to tread. My light will always illuminate your way. Therefore, I encourage you to press forward, living in the truth of my word, persisting in prayer. It is through this that you will witness my wisdom manifest in your life prospering your journey. So once more I say to you, my dear child, rise up, lift your heart and declare my word. Proclaim your freedom, knowing that no curse, no bondage, no chain can hold you back. For I am with you, illuminating your path, protecting you and loving you. I shall never abandon you. I will always be by your side, guiding you and bestowing blessings upon every facet of your life. On this beautiful day, accept my peace and the blessing I send from heaven. Today I anoint you and clothe you in spiritual garments of goodness. Today I renew my commitment to you, so that my light may shine in your life, making you a reflection of love and forgiveness for those who seek answers amidst their chains. My beloved child, today I empower you to undo the works of evil, to share my truth with humility with those who seek light in the midst of darkness. Trust in me, my dear child. Trust that I will guide your steps with love and wisdom. I will make you a happy, prosperous, and blessed person. I love you, my child. Only I know what is best for you, so place your trust in me. I will take care of your concerns, doubts, and fears. My child, heed my advice. Do not ignore my wisdom, for it will lead to your prosperity in all aspects of life. For I am your God, your Heavenly Father, the one who created you and gave you life. I called you from the farthest corners of the earth, from the remotest places, and said, You are my child, I have chosen you and predestined you. So do not be afraid, for I am with you. Do not be discouraged, for I am your God, strengthening you. I will always help you. I will always support you with my righteous hand. Today you must understand that if you want to lead a fulfilling, happy and abundant life, you must learn to listen to me and follow my guidance. I know it won't be easy, but it is what's best for you. I have created you and shaped you with my hands, and only I know what is best for you. Therefore, I implore you not to disregard my wisdom or turn away from my words for they are the foundation for a fulfilling life filled with joy and invaluable blessings. That's why I urge you to follow my advice 
for only in doing so will you attain a life full of peace, love, and prosperity. A life brimming with significant achievements and abundant blessings. So, when trials come your way, or you face challenges that make you feel alone and abandoned, remember that I'm with you, and you can trust in me. I brought you into this world with a unique and sacred purpose, not to let you suffer. Hold on to my hand, my beloved child. Cling to it with strength at all times. Walk with certainty and conviction, knowing that I will never let go. I will be your constant guide, your firm support in every step you take. I will help you achieve your goals and fulfill all your dreams. My hand will always hold yours. You need only trust and remember that if you place all your worries, doubts, and fears in me, I will make them disappear. I will solve your problems and dispel your fears, for I am your God, strong and vigilant, guarding the well-being of my children and meeting their needs. Therefore, my child, I implore you not to stray onto dark paths. Remain steadfast in faith. Stand on the rock that is Christ. Nothing and no one can topple you, not even the evil one who prowls like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. So, my child, do not give up. Do not doubt my word. Trust in it, for I have grand plans for you. Though you may not see the path clearly now, I know where each step will lead you. Just believe in me. Let my wisdom and the light of my word guide you, for in them you will find the way to happiness and success, a path that will lead you to green and gentle pastures where you will discover the path to victory, joy, and prosperity. Therefore, do not falter, my child. Continue forward like a brave warrior, a man of valor, unashamed and exemplary in faith. A man who obeys and imparts the message of truth with humility to those who seek light amid the darkness. Trust in me, my child. Trust that I will guide your steps with love and wisdom. I will make you a happy, prosperous, and blessed person. Remember that I shall forever be by your side, not only when things go well, but also when everything turns difficult and adverse. For each challenge you encounter in your life will be an opportunity to grow and fortify yourself. Every obstacle shall become a gateway that draws you closer to new experiences and newfound wisdom. Place your trust in the notion that despite the darkest moments, my light shall illuminate your path. My plans for your life will perpetually transcend any adversity, as I shall transform significant trials into great opportunities. Every step of faith shall serve as the foundation upon which you build the trust and courage requisite for achieving your dreams. Therefore, never yield, for I am your strength and salvation. I am your loving Father who will always aid you, protect you, and provide for your every need. You can confide in me, as I shall lead you to the garden of my promises, the desired place where you can accomplish all that you set out to achieve. Remember that I plucked you from the far reaches of the earth, predestined you to be worthy, happy, and blissful. Simply heed my counsel, and so it shall be. You shall lead a life brimming with blessings and happiness, Nothing shall impede the fruition of my promises in your life. Press onward with the certainty that I, your Father, shall steer you towards the path of prosperity, propelling you towards a future imbued with love, success, and joy. Be at ease, do not rush or despair, for you shall emerge victorious from this situation, because in me you are more than a conqueror. Beloved, in this world, there will always be harsh and arduous circumstances that you may not always control. Indeed, there will be times when you face tragic situations that will test your faith and character. Situations that will attempt to unsettle you. But rest assured, trust in me, and I assure you that all shall be well. For I have conquered the world, and in me, you are more than a conqueror. Hence, it is essential that you comprehend that life in this world will not always be a bed of roses. 
There will be moments when you feel the pressure of problems. But remember that in the midst of the storm, I am your secure refuge. My loving arms are always open to support and console you in times of need. I also implore you not to disregard the treacherous and deceptive terrain that the enemy will lay before you. For he will seek to immerse you in the illusions of this world, its vain riches, power, and earthly pleasures. His deceitful voice will make these things appear enticing to your eyes, but they are ephemeral and can lead to the ruin and destruction of your soul. Yet, be wise and prudent. Build your life upon the solid rock that is Christ Jesus. Stand firm in Him, so that when the trial comes, nothing shall cause you to stumble. You can remain secure and confident despite the storms. Keep in mind that the world may seem enticing, but its beauty is fleeting, and its promise of satisfaction is deceitful. In my love and my word, you will find a lasting refuge and an inexhaustible source of peace and joy. Do not be swayed by the shallow current of this world. Instead, root yourself in me, and you will discover a peace that surpasses all understanding. My child, be aware that the enemy will always seek to sow doubt and fear in your heart. But fear not, for I have equipped your hands with the sword of the Spirit, which is my word. With it, you can resist the enemy's attacks and wage the good fight of faith. It is crucial that you keep your heart and mind focused on my word, so you are not led astray by the enemy's distractions. Stand firm in my truth, and you will find the guidance and wisdom you need to overcome any challenge. Remember that your life in this world does not mean that you will never face difficulties. It means that even in the midst of trials, you can have the confidence that I am with you and my love and power are greater than any obstacle you may encounter. So, walk with the assurance that I will never forsake you or leave you alone in your times of need. I will always be by your side, supporting you, guiding you, and giving you the strength you require. No matter how dark the path you are traversing, my light will shine in the darkness and show you the way to victory. Do not grow weary of doing good. No matter how arduous the circumstances in which you find yourself, continue to be a beacon of love, hope, and compassion in a world that at times appears shrouded in darkness. Never forget that your faith in me empowers you to be a source of light amid the shadows. Your acts of love and kindness shall bestow blessings upon those who surround you. This world may pose challenges, but always remember that I have already overcome the world. With this truth in your heart, rise and confront each day with courage and confidence. I assure you that you shall triumph and experience the fullness of a prosperous, victorious, and blessed life. I know what transpired on that day. I witnessed what occurred. Leave the anger in my hands, allow me to enact my justice. Those who harmed you shall witness my favor upon you. They shall see how I bless you, even in the midst of scarcity. For I honor those who honor me. I love those who love me. I care for all my children, for they are my most exquisite creation. Fear not, for the worst has passed. Do not distress, for I am here to soothe your pain. Neither shall anyone nor anything harm you, for I intrude you with my precious blood. The malevolent seek to intimidate you, employing those you love to inflict harm upon you, but you must stand strong, you must resist. I shall not allow them to hurt you as they did in the past. I am safeguarding your heart at this very moment, for I dwell within it. Thus, believe me when I say that all that is ill has already passed. Let me console you in this moment of sorrow. Let me work my wonders within you. Do not lead your days in despondency. Do not let the feelings of pain and anger consume you. Fill yourself with my presence, 
Fill yourself with my peace. Behold, I command you to muster strength and be valiant. Fear not, nor falter, for I am your God who upholds you. Raise your gaze to the heavens. I shall rescue you from this situation and reveal the path you ought to tread. I shall satisfy you and place my blessings and provision upon your table. For if you trust in me, nothing shall be lacking. There will not be a single moment when I depart from your side. I shall always be there for you. You shall be free, beloved daughter. You shall be free, cherished son. Continue under my shadow, beneath the shelter of your omnipotent God. Repent of all your sins and give me a pure and sincere heart. Allow me to cleanse your garments. I shall clothe you in white, breaking all the chains that bound you, dispelling all oppressive thoughts. The malevolent spirits that tormented you depart at this very moment. I declare you free. Do not open your door to the world's refuse. Do not permit them to soil your pure and clean heart. Distance yourself from those who harm you. Leave behind false friendships. No longer engage with those who cause you harm. Do not seek them out. Associate with friends who contribute to your growth, individuals who study my word, who delve into my scriptures. Remember, as stated in Proverbs, that iron sharpens iron. Do not squander your time on those undeserving. Close your ears to the counsel of fools. Wait upon my will. I know it is difficult, but it is necessary for the fulfillment of what I have promised you. Be patient. Do not fret about tomorrow. Do not despair. What must transpire will occur in due time, for you are aware that my timing is impeccable. Do not take my words lightly. Store them deep within your heart, for on the day of distress, they shall provide you with solace and support. I tell you once more, I am with you. I am your helper, the one who extends a hand to you when all others abandon you, the one who raises the fallen, the one who heals the sick. I have done it before and I shall do it again. In these times, many have lost their way. They have corrupted their hearts, opting for earthly pleasures over what is necessary. Living without me is tempting, but living with me is a blessing. As I mentioned to you on that occasion, the life of a believer is not simple. Many will depart, many will go away. Yet this is necessary. The world may close its doors to you, but I shall open others. Doors you have never crossed, doors of blessing, doors of opportunity, for what I have promised in your life, I shall fulfill. Remember that he who sows prayer reaps answers. I listen to you, beloved daughter. I listen to you, cherished son. Each word that escapes your lips, I receive with love. I enjoy hearing from you, learning about your day to day, and having you share your troubles with me. I shall always be here to offer guidance. From now on, beloved daughter, lift your gaze, raise your eyes to the sky, and trust to me what lies beyond your control. Allow me to take care of those who harm you. I say it once more. I shall enact my justice upon you. I shall bless you before those who criticize you. You need not worry any longer, for I shall fulfill what I have told you. Believe it, for so it shall be. Treasure this message deep within your heart. Remember my words, for they shall comfort and sustain you on the day of adversity. Amen.